Okay, we are all set. Let's fly a circuit from the world's lowest airfield. This runway is just under 4,000 feet in length. Looking at the wind sock, we have a slight crosswind blowing from right to left out of the west. And rotate. Gear up. And flaps up. Bar Yehuda Traffic, TBM Golf Golf Yankee, joining the crosswind for the circuit. Climbing to minus 200 feet will put us at about 1,000 feet above the ground for a typical pattern. And we roll out to complete the 90 degree turn and ease back on the power. We are now about 900 feet above the ground. We are making a fairly wide circuit that will put us over the Dead Sea for a portion of the pattern. Bar Yehuda traffic, TBM, Gulf Gulf Yankee, turning left downwind, runway 18. This is a fast airplane, so I'm making a wide circuit to provide ample time to set up for landing. Dropping the landing gear at the mid downwind point. Setting the flaps to the first notch. Dialing in some elevator trim to take the pressure off the oak. On the downwind, I now have time to explain this craft. This figure shows the data recorded from 10,000 TBM 930 landings plotting attitude against airspeed. Optimal landings are in the sweet spot. Landings greater than 90 knots and pitch attitudes less than 3 degrees places the aircraft in the caution zone with prop strike potential. 77 to 87 knots indicated with a 3 to 7 degree nose up attitude at 50 feet above the ground places your landings in the ideal spot to avoid potential prop strike. The ideal configuration is to fly the final at a slow airspeed reaching 1.3 of the stall speed on short final and then flare to hold the nose up for a full stall touchdown. It is time to make our call for the base leg. Bar Yehuda traffic, TBM, Gulf Gulf Yankee, turning left base, Runway 18, full stop. And lowering the flaps to the final position for landing. I aim for an indicated airspeed of 85 knots with the aircraft fully configured for landing.
Bar Yehuda Traffic, TBM, Gulf Golf Yankee, turning final, runway 18, full stop. practiced the circuit at this airfield three times before making this recording. Making a gradual slow turn to line up with final Watching the map display closely, not to overshoot the runway alignment. Just easing the aircraft around to line up with the runway. We now have about a one mile final. Gradually bleeding off airspeed to about 85 knots indicated. Descending at about four to 500 feet per minute. Approach is stabilized. We have a slight crosswind from right to left. 